I'm Rachel. Thanks for joining the Ohana Adventure. Today I'm going to show you our discount Easter baskets and our Christ-centered Easter baskets, which is actually combined. So after holidays, I like to shop in the clearance section of the post-holiday sales. So like Christmas, I go afterwards and I get, um, you know, Christmas like stocking stuffers and um, candies and treats and things like that that they have marked halfway to half down so last year after Easter I went in and it was even a couple days after Easter I went into Walmart and they had tons of stuff marked down so I'm going to show you that they have these glow headbands and I really like to find things that are not candy we definitely put candy in the Easter baskets but I like to have things um, that maybe they could play with or entertain themselves so after Easter last year, I found these glow headbands. They have glow bunny ears, and this one has eggs. And these were originally $3. I actually got them at like 75% off, and 75 cents for each of these. And then these bunnies were like a dollar, so it made them a quarter. Um, that was a really good deal. I also found these paddle balls. They were also a quarter. Um, I found these pencils, so this whole pack was a quarter. This was like, I think it might have even been more than 75% off, like 80% off. So these were really, really cheap. Quarter, maybe 10 cents. These pack of um, spring party favorite Easter, whatever, designs of erasers. Those were really cheap, so I'm gonna put those in this little bag, um, maybe with a little bit of treats. I found these lip gloss. My girls love lip gloss, and this was really cheap also. The boys will love this. This is a game, the pop and catch game, where you pop it and then the other person catches it. And I found some cuddlies for my little girls. These were really, really cheap. This one was, I wanna say, even less than a quarter, and this one was probably like 50 to 75 cents. That was a really good deal. And then these eggs that have tattoos in them. I always like to find other things to entertain them besides, of course, treats. We love our treats though, so post-holiday sales are excellent. I am a sucker for Cadbury Mini Eggs, and I got six of these bags, and they were 10 cents each after Easter last year. Um, hubby loves the Reese's pieces, or the Reese's peanut butter cups, so I got the Reese's bunnies for him, and this one I think was 50 cents for the pack. All kids love the malt eggs, and we got this pack for 50 cents. And then I just have a bunch more of those mini eggs. So this is our discount post-holiday stuff that we're gonna go into our basket. So we talked about our cheap post-holiday stuff that I got from Walmart. All of these were awesome things. And it seems like a lot, but just remember, I have six kids. And when it's spread out, it is not that done, that much. Okay, so I'm gonna show you our Christ-centered items that we got so that our kids can remember the true meaning of Easter. And Easter, we believe, is about Jesus Christ and when he died and then was resurrected. And Easter, the egg, represents new life. And because Jesus was resurrected, that means he has new life and he lives. We wanted to buy things that would remind our kids about the true meaning of Easter. Not just the bunnies and the fun Easter egg hunts and the treats, but the reason why we celebrate it, and that's for Jesus Christ. So. I went to a store down um, in the valley and it is called Seagull Book or Deseret Book. These are kind of church stores where you can find church um, scripture, Bible oriented things, which was awesome because that's what we wanted. So I went and I found, so all the kids got a journal and they were awesome. They were only, these nicer ones were only $2. So these are the big girls. Then I went to the dollar store and I found these ones. These are a little bit smaller. Um, for my other kids that can write. And then for Cora, who's only three, we gave her some nice cute little notebooks because she's only three. So we got a journal for all of the kids. We also got scripture markers for when we read our scriptures, you can mark um, favorite passages or um, things that you want to remember when you go back. So each of the big kids got um, scripture markers. And then Cora and Evie got these awesome scripture crayon markers. And they are actually erasable, which is fabulous because we know little kids like to color. So we got the erasable scripture markers for the little girls. I also found at that store pictures of Jesus. And these are great because they depict different times in his life. And this is him as the shepherd. Um, and this is him 
when he is baptized. Um, this is him helping a small child, another child. This is Jesus when he comes out of the tomb. And then we also have um, Jesus with uh, Mary Magdalene. So these are also awesome pictures so that they can put them on their walls or use them as bookmarks, whatever. And we also got a pack of temples so that they can have something to look forward to in the temple. Uh, we go and we do more worship in the temples. And so we love to have pictures of the temples that are around. So each of them got a picture of the temple as well as a picture of Jesus. And at the dollar store, I found some great little non-treat things that they could do or use. I found um, this six pack of egg shaped chalk, which is great. I love chalk, it comes off. I also found a four pack of Play-Doh. So some of the younger kids got the Play-Doh. And then as well as bookmarks. So everyone got a bookmark for their scriptures or just for their regular books. So this is a bunch of awesome Christ-centered Easter basket fillers. They were fun, I hope you guys liked them. And now we're going to assemble everything. Ta -la -la -la. <laughs> toys that may not have been divided equally in the mom and dad one so that I can give it to the kids maybe I feel like need it um, later on but here is our Easter baskets we've got our Christ centered um, we've got our Christ centered items in our Easter baskets as long uh, along with our post holiday cheap sales I think um, total it cost about $30 for all of these Easter baskets including the treats which I got after Easter last year and the um, toys that we got after Easter last year. So that makes it less than $5 a basket, which was awesome. Totally awesome. I reuse the eggs every year. I keep them in a bag as well, along with the baskets and the Easter grass. So those things we reuse, we don't have to rebuy them. So $30 makes it less than $5 an Easter basket. It was a good deal. We have our Christ centered things so we can focus on the true meaning of Easter and have some fun and treats along with it. You, thanks for joining us, guys. Thanks for joining our Ohana. Please subscribe, share it with your friends. We wanna hit 500 subscribers by the end of this month and we're gonna do a huge giveaway. We want you to be one of the winners. So please share this with your friends and leave some comments below. Tell me what you guys are doing for Easter or what's in your Easter basket. Have a good weekend, happy Easter, and mahalo. Mahalo.